name's Hedy. I'm the big cheese founder of travel gift card mytub.co. It is a .co. It is not a .com. This is an incredibly hot dog that's nine for water, but we're filming and so she will take it. She will be a trooper and she will survive. Today we're talking about web editing. A few different ways to do it. You've got something very simple like WordPress. So if you look at like different websites, there's different ways that uh, they, they, the company can update parts of the website without having to go to the tech team and change the whole of the layout again. Probably because it's based on and parts of it is based on WordPress. WordPress is a separate site that is integrated with the main website, but the customer doesn't see that. But the people who are running the company can change content. Like if you go over to my tabs, frequently asked questions. I can change that, my tech team doesn't need to. But if you want to look at the actual main design of my tab and the landing page, etc., no, my tech team need to do that when it's above and beyond and way over the top of my head. I'm going to show you a few different examples, come with me. Okay, so we're looking at my tab's old design version. Okay, our travel gift card, looking down here now, you can see here where it says get started now, see who's fundraising, etc., blah, blah, blah. Um, these are all parts that I can't change. I can't change because I'm a complete numpty and I haven't got a clue what I'm doing with this one. So these images, these graphics, etc., they're all there. Now this is a new design layout and this is what we've done now, which absolutely is beautiful and absolutely completely gorgeous. This part is already static. I can't change this. I can't play around with it. But where you can see the bottom, the Marcom, Marketing Communications, I can play around with this. So now we're in WordPress for a split second and I do, I'm not going to sign in because I don't need to know our details, but have a look down here now. Where you look looking about us there, have a look at this. Ah, look at this, it's got the same kind of content. Well, actually I'm looking at two different versions. But if you look down here now on the about us section down here, this is what it shows. It shows the same content, okay? So if you go into about us here now, one secondo, uno momentum. Have a look down here, what we do. It's a social travel gift card. It's a social travel gift Can you see? I can edit that information myself. Very, very easy to do, but the main gist of the site, no, I can't edit. Our tech team needs to do that. So remember, when you're doing web editing, most companies end up using WordPress. There might be certain parts like, say you've got a cafe or a bakery, a bakery, a bakery that's selling bakes. That's not, it's selling cakes. What if you go into a bakery and you go to their website and you're basically looking at the top about special offers. Now, the main website might be static and it might be read only and you can't really do anything about that from the owner's point of view because it's already been pre-designed because they're always going to sell the certain kind of cakes again and again and again. But the prices might be editable through a WordPress site where they can change the pricing down there different times of the year or different offers. It's really, really simple. Some is static and other parts of it is it can be edited through WordPress. My name's Hedy. And the big cheese founder of travel gift card mytab.co. It is a .co. It is not a .com. This is a hot dog, and the name's Muppet. Have a brilliant one.